So we're near Westminster Cathedral Piazza, and along with the piazza and the railway station and the coach station, uh, they're places that people who end up sleeping well, uh, they flee to all over the country. Um, in the middle of Westminster, generally about 200 people who are sleeping rough each night. Very few of them have any local connection whatsoever, but their situations, although individually different, are backed by complex factors. Um, life breakdown, family breakdown, getting drawn into drugs, uh, minor criminality. Life has broken up in a really bad way for them. So what can you do? Uh, and what do we do as a council? Well, as a council, we have one of the most extensive networks of social care partnership with charities across the country. And every rough sleeper will be offered pretty much every day a chance to come in. But as anyone who's met the street population knows, they don't always want to do that. They mistrust authority, and it takes a lot of time to persuade them to get their life sorted. Sadly, a few of them never will. They've become broken. Trauma has affected their life. It doesn't mean they're nice people all the time, they've been threatening to you or your neighbours, but what can you do? Well, the most important thing is to report what you see. Use Streetlink, which is a, a website, a telephone line. Look at the information sheet that we've got attached to this video, and you can see a range of charities, St Mungo's, The Passage, The Hidden Network, collective charities, all of which are going to help you to help them. Uh, don't pass by. Find out who they are if you feel up to it, say hello, but don't give them money, don't give them food. Get the charities to do that. That's how you can best help. Thanks.